Rob. Hi, Alan. Very glad to have you. Um, I have heard about your interesting story. Would you mind sharing with our audience a bit about your ventures? Sure. Uh, so seven years ago, um, um, I started a research business in Hong Kong, and we focus on China housing markets um, through a very data-driven analytics. Uh, but then, more relevant to your conference here, uh, a few years ago we started writing our own software to solve our own problems in automation of research and data collection. And then fast forward, a few years ago we carved it out as robotic online intelligence as a separate venture, where we have now separate clients and data companies, some hedge funds, um, people who do research. Um, so that's been quite an interesting journey. Like You do it, you build it for yourself uh, so you know it works and then carve it out for others. So how do you use AI? So the AI part comes in our case in the form of, um, uh, we use neural networks for classification um, and we optimize it for short text, for example, for the Twitter feed, for the headlines from the news, um, where with those parameters, it works quite well. In some cases, we can get 90% accuracy in terms of classification of text, whether it belongs to a certain category or whether it's relevant and that really optimizes the time and the filtering process. So what gets you most excited about tech or say the data space? So we're a little bit different. So you know, Many people talk about algorithmic stuff like fitting into the machines. We obsess more about the old problem of information overload for the humans. Mm -hmm. So feeding how, how we as humans absorb information, how we handle it in the internal workflow within the firm. Um, that's the, the issues we are trying to address through automation, through the workflow solution, uh, and ultimately think of it as the ultimate neural network here, right? And what content feeds we should handle, we should feed in, and how we should handle that. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So, um, my last question for you: Is it the second time you passed to pay, you participated in our conference? Um, do you have any feedbacks or impressions you want to share? about our conference. Yes, yeah, so I saw you in Beijing in yeah. July <laughs> and uh, now here in New York. Um, uh, I really enjoyed Barrel Elite conferences. Um, I think you guys, uh, you put together high quality content, good speakers, no nonsense, straight to the point, very educational, um, very impressed. Um, and uh, on the fun side, uh, clearly people know that you have this sort of artistic angle to it yeah. with performances <laughs> and design. And, and it makes sense because you could say, you know, when we talk about data science and all of that, it's often more art than science, and that's an important part of that. Oh, that's an important, it's a quite interesting point. Thank you for sharing with us, Rob. Thanks for having me. Thanks, Alan. Thank you. <laughs>